Smile, Starseed Smile. Let me talk to you a little bit about you, uh, Starseeds. Listen, guys, uh, I just want you to know that you are doing a great job. And there's a message being sent to you from more beings than you can possibly imagine. You guys have got a huge team around you, as does any entity that's in human form. Huge, huge team behind you, all on, on so many different levels. And when uh, mo most starseeds, most of them, not all, but most of them by far, heart large percentage, what happened was Gaia sent out a call to get some help to bring these vibrations in, and y'all came a-running. Y'all came a-running. People who come here to have the experience of this um, duality, uh, there's a lot of, even though there's no such thing as time, there's a lot of pre-planning, and it takes uh, a long time to fully get yourself in a state of amnesia. Okay, so part of the reason why you're not completely in amnesia is that takes planning and setup and and it's tricky and it's different for every single being. It really is. So and like I said in the other video, being amnesia is key to plays, it plays a big, big role in being happy here. So the less amnesia you have, the more likely you are to be sad and depressed. Okay, and you knew that before you came in. And you set up your amnesia, your level of amnesia, as far as you could get it in correlation with whatever your job was going to be whenever you got here, right? Okay, so uh, a lot of you have just got this knowingness. You don't have, you, you still consider yourselves in big time amnesia. In reality, you've got a lot of knowingness. You just don't know how to interpret it. It's like listening to somebody else speaking a foreign language right next to you but you can't tell what the words mean. Well, that's what you're doing. You've got a lot of knowingness, but because you don't know how to translate it into English, then it's just this knowingness, this blank knowingness, and that knowingness makes you sad. But I want you guys to know that uh, you are not alone, that you are surrounded by mobs and mobs of of entities that are supporting you in being here, as is everyone, no matter if you have been here for millions of lives or this is your first life. But there is logic as to why you're sad. And I just want to give you guys uh, credit. I want you to know that that uh, you to validate that sadness and depression and give you a uh, a way to understand that so that you can step through it and beyond. Once you understand where it's coming from, for me, it was then much easier to move through it and find happier and happier. All right. But I wanted to do a, how about shout out to every star seed from all of the beings that are supporting you because every being who has agreed, every human being that has agreed to come here and play this role in this game very complex game, uh, there are an infinite number of, of beings that are watching you in total amazement and awe. Now, I know the rules are pretty strict here in, in human land about what humans consider to be successful or unsuccessful or courageous or not courageous, but I want you guys to know that whether Starseed or uh, long-term human, it doesn't matter. Anybody who agreed to come and play this role, um, especially during this time frame, that takes a lot. Uh, you guys are really up there, and there are a lot of beings that are rooting for you, that are supporting you, that uh, there is so much more beings out there where there's no judgment. The judgment is really coming more from 3D and 4D entities, not from anyone else. What you're doing is stupendous. And even if you're a serial killer and whatever horrible thing you can imagine, it's still stupendous that you had the guts to come and do this, to put your feet on this ground in human form. So I want you all to smile. Just give me a little smile here. Just give me a little smile. Okay? Because I want you guys to know that you are doing an awesome job and everyone is in awe and amazement 
for what you are doing and what you've done. And whether you've come here for millions of lives or if you've come for this short-term starseed gig. Uh, for all the beings that are going from 3D to 5D in one lifetime uh, that are attempting to do that, you wouldn't. I wish that I could take it from my head and my heart and give it to all of you. I, I wish I could just give it to you so that you would be aware. So when you do have a tough uh, moment in the day that you could fall back on that. And even though you don't have the feeling, I know that by me saying these words, there will be a knowingness with it too. So if you're having a, a, a rocky day, if you're having trouble, pull up this video and look into my eyes and hear my voice that you are loved, you are not alone, that this isn't a waste of time, you're not crazy. Um, the vibrations are stronger and, and better. All you've got to do is reach for them. I know it's tough, but you can do this. You can do this. You are doing it, right? You're here. You are doing it. So I want you to remember that and take this video and listen to this video. And I am speaking for your higher selves. I'm speaking for all of your pub friends. I'm speaking for all of the aliens that are working with and around you. Uh, I, am, I am speaking for all of the entities that are just watching, uh, the historians that are recording, the source as a whole for the appreciation that source that we all have as a whole for the experience, experience experiential vibrations that are be ad, being added to the whole right now. That each one of you is moment to moment perspective and experience is so, so, so amazing. And it is creating so much that you, you will be amazed and take a deep breath. Give me a little smile and just try to remember that one day you will see this. You will see this all from a higher bigger perspective. It will all make sense. And you're going to be very, very proud of yourselves and all of us, all of us. Okay. So smile humans. Give me a smile. Try to be happier and happier every day. Find that hidden gem of something that makes you happier and spend your time doing that. Okay. Try to remember this is the game. It's a Probably the best, most interactive, uh, intense, holographic uh, video game ever created. So try to remember it from that standpoint. And remember that you are awesome. You're awesome. You are loved. You're not alone. And this will make sense. It really will make sense. Okay? All right, guys, I love you all so, so much, and I'll talk to you later. Oh, by the way, um, working really, really hard on the website here. Uh, I think you guys are going to be excited about the stuff that's on it. Um, we're going to have a monthly newsletter, and with each month, I'm going to have, uh, Stephanie's going to draw and talk a little bit about a new magical creature, and this will be a part of the just the website. Of course, then you'll be able to buy her books. I'm t kind of toying with um, a daily, weekly kind of lesson plan like thing, like like have something that we work on specifically that'll be a part of that site with with things that you can do. Um, but there's uh, there's a lot on it. It looks really nice. Um, hope you all come and join us. And uh, yeah, I've been working since I came out of the NDE uh, because before that, Stephanie has been an herbologist for years and years and years. So she's got a lot of knowledge. So after that, whenever I was getting well, we started getting into, you know, essential oils and healing oils and creams. So I've decided that uh, I'm going to go ahead and make those and sell those as well. Uh, those also come with my personal charge to the cream in the essence, which makes it a little bit different. I also use uh, a lot of other ways. I don't just make the cream in the essence of oils. And if I'm going to do them for you, I'm going to do them how I do them for me. 
mainly because I know they work, um, to do this thing. I'm not going to do any edible anything because I don't want to be involved with the FDA or, or any of that stuff. So it'll all be topical. But that being said, topical, when asked, can affect anything internally in the body. But I like to work with all of the elementals as much as I can because, uh, well, I just like them and they're very, very powerful. And they work really well with the physical body. So uh, I've decided to go ahead and do that. I hadn't really originally uh, was going to do that. And I think I'll also do some jewelry. Uh, again, that will be specific to uh, the, the, that energy. I mean, those that jewelry be specifically charged to do a certain thing. Uh, maybe I'll even do personal ones. Would you guys like that? If I did personalized ones, um, I think I could do that pretty easily. Take a little more time, but um, that might be, you guys might really, that might be very advantageous for you guys. All right, well, let me know. Hopefully, <laughs> I haven't had time to do emails or comments or anything here because I really want to get this this website up on April 1st because I just love that date and it's a new moon too. So, all right, enough of that. Okay, guys, uh, like I said, give me a smile, huge hugs. I love you so much and I'll talk to you again later. Bye now.